What's going on everybody? This is Patrick Minton Outdoors. Thanks for checking in on this Saturday. Um, I told you every now and then I'd get a Saturday video out there. I'm going to try to get as many of them as I can. Uh, if I'm out on the trail or out fishing or out doing something like last weekend, um, my daughter had the thing down at the Frizz Center in downtown Nashville, which was a big deal for her and for us. And um, so I photographed it, videoed some down there and uh, shared it with you guys. So you're going to get those kind of videos on Saturday sometimes. This one is going to be a, kind of a channel update on where the channel's going. Now we're real close to the 1,000. Uh, if we hit the 1,000, awesome, great. We're going to keep building. I don't plan on slowing down. I know it looms over a bunch of us that the demonetization and non-partnership is going to happen. But I don't think that's such a bad thing. And the more I think about it, I mean, I would love to be able to continue on as a partner with YouTube since I've been one for five years now. But if I lose that and lose the monetization, then it kind of loosens some of the thumb screws that are held on some of these channels. Um, with that, I mean, you still got to follow the rules and you don't need to be doing dumb stuff, you know. Don't be going to cemeteries. Anyway, um, all that aside, let's talk about Mid-10 Outdoors. Ordered stickers. Yep, I have ordered stickers. Uh, they're coming in. If you follow me on Instagram, if you don't follow me on Instagram, go down below. Click on the Instagram link. Go to Instagram and tell me you come from YouTube so I know to subscribe back to you on Instagram. <clears throat> but I put it on Instagram today. Or was it last night? Today. Last night. I did it last night. Um, <clears throat> and also, I'm going to drop it on the website. Now, on the website, this is one of the ways you can help me with you know, the fact that I'm going to lose monetization probably, which really didn't do anything for me. So, I mean, this may be some other way of doing it is I'm going to start doing a little merch on the website. And I know everybody's probably going, oh God, he said the word merch, merchandise. <clears throat> but I'm going to put my stickers on there at some point. They're kind of on there. There's a picture of it. Um, doesn't have anything really listed about it yet. So it says out of stock, which they are. They're not here yet. Uh, be here towards, I think, towards the end of next week, maybe first of the next We'll see. Um, I'm going to be giving out some of them. And one of the ways you can get one as soon as they come in, come in will be at the end of this video. So, with that said, what am I looking for? Why, why am I going to give away my, one of my first stickers? Well, here's one of the reasons. I want a nickname for my audience. For the people that watch my channel regularly that um, you know we stay in contact quite a bit and, and trust me I've got a lot of people I stay in contact with and uh, we converse back and forth on comments there's a lot of good people on YouTube there's a lot uh, something I heard today uh, somebody said you know is YouTube getting too crowded it may feel like we're bumping elbows a little bit but think of this right now there's one point I think it was the, the, now I may be wrong totally on the numbers, but 1.5 billion, not million, billion people on YouTube right now. Within the next two years, they're saying that could climb from anywhere from 3.3 billion to 5 billion people on YouTube. I, you, there's plenty of room then, folks. So with that said, I need something to call the people that support my channel and that watch my channel and that are regulars and you know I want to call them something. Now I, I thought since I'm mid-10 outdoors I could say outdoorsman. Well guess what? There's a lot of women that watch my channel and there's a lot of kids that watch my channel. So that'd be kind of a slap in the face to them to call them outdoorsmen because they're outdoors women. So I need something to call them down below once again 
Give me a give me a nickname for my audience. Uh, keep it clean. Keep it clean. And keep it fun. That's what I ask. And um, yeah, we'll start. Uh, we'll give my audience a nickname. I thought of one. Let me know if you like it or not. I thought about the outdoorsies. Mid ten outdoorsies. Like I said, leave a comment down below if you think of something a lot better. Um, I've been trying to think of something myself. I just, uh, I don't know. Anyway. Um, so, let's see what else we got going on. Um, got a camp, new camera coming. I'll let you know more about that. But it'll be bumping me into 1080 instead of 720 which is what this one films on now I know a lot of you people and me um, even at work where I've got straight on straight up internet you know I'm plugged in I'm not Wi-Fi like here um, I get anything above actually I've seen it knocking down as far as 480 and it's struggle some days here at the house I'm on Wi-Fi uh, we've done a lot of stuff trying to get the Wi-Fi as strong as we can get it and 480 is hard to, you know, hard to do here. Um, I found out if I come out here to upload, I upload in like 15 minutes. I do it in the house, it can take up to two hours. And which, which the, the Wi-Fi thing is just right up that way in my daughter's bedroom. And you're probably saying, well, why is it there? Well, there's no place I could put it because where the fiber came into the house, and the nearest thing was right there and so they put it up there to try to reach all the way across the house I got a 2200 square foot house and it, it yeah. so if anybody out there is good with um, maybe expanding my Wi-Fi network uh, send me a message tell me what I could do different I do uh, here I have no choice but TDS telecom which is still it's still fiber um, I could probably bump up a couple packages and get a little bit better and we'll see if I can talk the wife into that one. Um, let's see what else have I got going on. Uh, fix clean up some knives that have been neglected the last few days. Sorry. Uh, uh, been lazy. Um, got the stickers coming out. Eventually I'm going to do something else. Probably be a hat. I always wear hats. So I may do a mid-10 outdoors hat, and I'm looking at maybe revamping the logo when it comes to those hats. Um, let me know what you think about that. Instead of just the mid-10 outdoors, just MTO. Yay? Nay? Let me know. So, this is an informational video. This is an audience participation video, so down below you got, you got some homework to do and uh, get back to me and we will see you on the next one so this is Patrick with Mid-10 Outdoors be prepared